Hi everyone, today we're unboxing and reviewing the Fnersi HS02 soldering iron. This is a smart, portable soldering iron that promises high performance and ease of use. Let's dive right in. First, let's take a look at the packaging. The box is compact and well designed, with all the key features listed on the front and back. It mentions a 100 watt power output fast heating, and intelligent temperature control. All right, let's open it up and see what's inside. Inside the box is a zippered soft case. Open it to see the body of the soldering iron. There is the FNERSI logo on it. Next, we have the instruction manual. This side has various startup pages and the main interface when in use. The maximum power of the soldering iron is 100 watts. The temperature can reach up to 450 degrees Celsius. This soldering iron opens by twisting it. The design is very clever. Okay, now let's take a look at the soldering iron tip. Plug it in. You need to use some force when you plug it in for the first time. A 100 watt Type C power cable is also included in the package. It's a Type C to C cable. Plug in the power supply. Turn it on, then press the OK button. The display shows the current temperature, set temperature, and the current voltage. There are three gears to choose from. Short, press the right button to increase the temperature. Okay, now let's find a circuit board and try soldering. Tin the soldering iron tip first. The power is sufficient and soldering is very smooth. Generally, for this kind of portable soldering iron, there is a problem of insufficient power. But now, let's solder a 1.5 square read-through line. You can see that the tinning is very smooth and there is no problem of insufficient power. Then, solder the larger ground pad on the PCB. The power is also sufficient. Generally, for a smart soldering iron with lower power, soldering this kind of high power pad will be slightly weak. To shut down, press and hold the OK button. To summarize, this FNERSI HS02 soldering iron supports a maximum power of 100 watts and uses a Type-C power supply for easy carrying. Take a look at the appearance and interface. It's very beautiful. Next, let's make some DIY projects. Here are some pictures and scenes of soldering with it. If you like this review video, then like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more tech reviews and unboxings. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.